Yeah, the idea today is it's just gonna be a chill chatting stream and uh just gonna have a bunch of music on. Now try and use song request. The way song request is going to work is that it's more it's more gonna be like taking turns. Like once like five like five songs or so get in the queue. Uh And I'll turn song request on. Then once it gets through that list, I'll turn my music back on, and that'll that'll make it so that there's not just like one thing in the queue for song request. All right, so let me amp the mic a little more. That might be is this better? It's not gonna sound ideal, but it should be better. Here, I'll move the mic a little closer too, and I can kind of see it. Farting is not acceptable. No, it got song requested, so it's staying in the queue. I have to get through those first. Alright. So let me move the keyboard. I don't actually need it on me. I guess this is Nightbot song request, so I think SoundCloud works too. I haven't killed Nightbot yet. Open the cube, though. Yes. So here's my GameCube. Original GameCube. Childhood GameCube. Uh, it's not a red edition. <laughs> These are just stickers, hence the purple buttons. But, uh, yeah, I guess not at some point. At some point, the disk drive in here stopped working. That's the reset button. Stopped working consistently. Like, in order to get the Oracle games played, I had to, like, restart the GameCube for, like, 20 minutes. Until eventually it read a disc to boot up the Game Boy player. So we're gonna nip that problem in the bud. By just replacing it with this, uh, mod chip here. Where is it? The GC loader. I need scissors to open it. I mean, I don't think it matters. I mean, if you want to buy my old disk drive and fix it for me and diagnose it, sure. I'm going to take this thing, which is way smaller and has an SD card slot, and use it instead. And then I can just boot straight to homebrew and stuff. That's the Pimp the GameCube solution. It's like a super easy mod chip from the YouTube video I looked at. So it has a plug here. If I can figure out where the webcam is. You just plug, you pl unplug the disk drive and plug this in. A lot of other mod chips, you have to like desolder stuff and all that. Too much work. Also. Here's this part on the side. So this is a replacement for, like, the top part where you, you would normally put the discs. Instead, you put the SD card. This is something you had to buy separate. Someone 3D prints these. I figured if I'm spending the money on the mod chip, might as well get that, too. Actually, this is a good... Oh, okay. Music just stopped. Well, that doesn't matter, because you need to look at the video on how to do this. So I, I already know, I already watched this. It's basically just taking out a trillion billion screws, but just skim. Make sure I have everything I need.
Alright, let's get into the actual process. Alright, we're, we're at step one here. Alright. Okay, I guess I, I know what to do here. So what he's saying is flip this over. There's some screws here. Is there a game port? Game port? Game bit? Whatever they're called. Okay, I thought the webcam froze for a second. So let's flip this over. Make sure you got all your tools ready. Got the magnetic parts tray. Actually, there's one screw sitting around. Uh-oh. Let me find it. Oof. Alright, let's get the songs back going. Alright, so I got my game bit screwdriver. Um, I had to order this off Amazon and wait for it. I did have the bit for this already, but when I looked at the end, it was all rounded off. Uh, so that, it wasn't going to work, unfortunately. It's okay, though. Alright, so here's one of them from the bottom. These bottom holes already taken out. I had to do a test. All right, so let's take these expansion port covers out. I guess if you know of the GameCube, but you don't remember it all the way, this the console had three expansion ports on the bottom, which in practice most people never used. I guess the two, one of them is completely unused. One of them was only... Uh, Uh, what was I saying? Basically, there's a bunch of ports on the bottom here for some reason. Oof. Right, I'm kind of melting. My thermo thermometer thing here says it's only only 75 degrees, but uh, feels hotter. I, got. I wish I could have the mic for, like, these clicks. There's, like, these nice, satisfying clicks when these screws come undone. It's okay. Not a hundred, though. Oh, no. Don't, don't unhype your song. Just let it play. I'm getting blasted with my 9900k exhaust. It's probably the issue. I almost feel like I'm building a new PC here. I got my iFixit kit, magnetic parts tray. Linus approved. Oh, oops. I was wondering why the song thing is off. Alright, so when I'm playing my music, exclamation mark song is the thing. When it's Nightbot, I have no clue. <laughs> the farts start playing. Alright, there we go. We got three screws that came out. Alright, so I'll need a Phillips head for everything else, but... I think it's the top piece here. Yeah, the top piece here slides off. What? So now here's this part of the GameCube. Just naked. Who would do this? So here's the whole, whole console. Um, so actually, something I should do, I didn't think about. This console is, uh... How old? 21 years old? 20? Almost on the dot. This console is like 19 years old. 
maybe 17. Uh, so this right here, is it even, it's not focusing. So that's, there we go. That's 19, 17 year old dust. Same with this side. So I think it might be a good idea to air this out. Um, unfortunately, that'll have to be just off stream. <laughs> I don't want to get dust. I want to get dust on the camera. I shouldn't have been eating. Dang it. That's okay. It's a thing I do. I always am eating, watching streams. Also, I knew this was going to mess up. Hold up. God, the text is cut off. Oh no. What do I do? I think that's good enough. Should have been eating. Um. Well, I know I just started the stream, but I'm going to walk away now because I need to air this console out. I think what I should do actually is take... Hmm. Yeah, I think I should take the disk drive out first and then dust it out. So let's... Let's uh, pause the music here and keep going in the video. What screwdriver do I need? Okay, so you're seeing like the exact same. A number two Phillips screwdriver. Uh what what is that? I got the kit here. Nothing here says two. Do they mean two O's? I've never seen numberings on a screwdriver bit. What music? Is it that quiet? Can I overcompensate in the volume? I guess I did pause it now. Right, let's, can we Google this? Is this a safe Google? Number... Hold up. Is this number two? Phillips. Screwdriver. Double O. Not the same thing as number two. I'm gonna guess it is. We don't hear the farting. I know. Number two is one quarter. The most common cross tip Phillips required. Maybe it, maybe I just don't have the number two. I mean, obviously, I just try bits until it fits. I was just curious. Two versus O O. Okay, so there's zero zero and then up the two. I have a one here. Surely that'll fit. Alright, whatever. Alright. Do I put on the farting? Do I actually just put on whatever's in song request, no context, and just walk away? For a minute so I can air this out. Because if I'm going to have to pop off the front and back. I'll save that for later. Actually the back can go ahead and come off. Just had the fart on. Alright so what is this in song request queue? Alright thank you. I'm scared. As you should be. Just don't request arts then. Sub for more. Should I show what... 
This is actually happening. Alright, I'm gonna VRV. Alright, so bear with me. Just gotta air this out real quick. It'll probably take a minute. Alright, am I going to get banned from Twitch? This is what something Zach requested. Alright, should I skip this? <laughs> Let's skip to farts. <laughs> How do I even skip with no song requests? There we go. Mega fart. <laughs> well, all right, we got the farting frog music. Now, let me get this controller assembly out the way. Alright, now I'm only going to get fart music requests. Not even what I'm after. Alright, so we got the controller assembly moved out the way. Fire. <laughs> Alright, it's got one more minute. I guess I'll leave it. Um, we gotta go back to this. Let me pause it. Okay, so I just need to get all the screws, alright. So hit me with good song requests. Match the vibe of the songs I had earlier. Make sure you don't have to. It's kind of limiting then. Just give me stuff that sounds like it came out in the last five years only.
I guess I'll let it resume. We'll just let the old joke song go through. Yo, he's farting. Alright, my screwdriver? Screws? Yeah, it needs to be number two. This is too small. The hecky? Let me get another screwdriver. Arting Couple Presents. Alright, we're skipping this one. We'll, we'll give it one second. Anyways, off to, on to the tunes. Alright, so hopefully the screwdriver works. I don't think... I'm not really going to get this on camera, but I'm taking out screws, I promise. One guy in the video was like, dude, this takes forever. Why well, have some, some indie pop, post rock, and andy, ambient? No, I need. The dumbest sounding genre name. I need some cuddlecore. I need some indie chill only. He's only request baby metal. It's okay, don't request whatever you like. Just no fart song. No fart. I mean, even like a fart joke song could be good, just like not only fart songs. Alright, so there's like a trillion billion of these. To adjust the volume a little. There we go. Screenplay. Like, whatever his name is. I guess I can't... Yeah, I'm not doing a good job of showing what I'm doing, but it's... It's hard, okay? What about if I do it from this side? These screws are, like, super tight, too. It's wild. I think all of this is just for the disk drive assembly, basically. Alright, is this screwdriver audible? Kind of a nice sound. It's one of those ratcheting screwdrivers. Makes the cranking sound. If you turn it the wrong way. So now the screwdriver sounds stream. Not that it wasn't already, I'm just unscrewing everything. I got this fan assembly on the side. I guess... 
In the video, when I watched it before, basically all the other screws were the same size. So. I don't think there's a chance I'm undoing something I shouldn't. I mean, there is a chance, I guess, but hopefully not. Uh, hello? Oh, wait. Yeah, I think my browser... Aw, oh, man. Alright. SoundCloud just requires a bit of manual fiddling. Because of my browser settings. Autoplay turned off. Okay, we can pull... Hold up. I'll show what I'm doing here. It's not a, not a big deal. I just gotta click two things. Alright, so this fan thing moves out the way. It's got like a squishy... Yeah, this is probably the reset button right here. I don't know if it's super visible. I need like an overhead camera thing. Why, the power plug goes through this, the fan, and the reset button. That's a weird hodgepodge of stuff. There's some screws hiding under here. Yeah, it's up, Kalma. Let's go! Well, yeah, I'm excited for this, too. So, the, a modded homebrewed GameCube is pretty sweet. I got the HDMI adapter. Like, I can play... Once I get this done, I can play whatever GameCube, Game Boy games... ...on a console with HDMI out. Let's go. Play Among Us on it. Someone would have to make a homebrew version of Among Us for GameCube. Someone maybe made Among Us for Wii. Alright. Um, let's go back to the video. I think there might be screws I'm missing. So we gotta take the disk drive out. There we go. The mod is GC Loader. It's a, it's a pretty sweet mod for, like, consoles. It's a plug-and-play disk drive replacement. So this is the plug. It just plugs into the console. And you put in SD cards. Instead of discs. Alright, unfortunately I'm gonna have to pause the songs. I need to go back to the video guide. GC Loader. P and P. That's yeah, a pretty sweet... Like, simple mod. Like, this probably will only take, like, 30 minutes to actually do. If I had to guess. There's no soldering or anything. Okay, so I missed some screws there. Oh no, GameCube, once again, GameCube is dead simple. The original model GameCubes basically have an HDMI port, so you can just buy an adapter. Let's see, what is it called? Kirby HDMI? Oh, okay, this keyboard is a little sus though. Yeah, you can literally just buy a $90 thing that plugs into your GameCube and gives you HDMI. I think I think the GameCube is the easiest retro console to pimp out. Aside from maybe the Xbox, and even then. I'm not sure how things have progressed on the Xbox front. I know since it's a PC, basically, it does natively do digital video, but I don't know if people have figured out how to just get HDMI out of an Xbox original.
Cables are so expensive. Wait, for GameCube? Yeah, well, I don't mean get, like, an original component cable. This is something that goes in the same port, but this is an HDMI adapter. That's 70 bucks US. It's actually, like, super cheap for a console pimp-out thing. It's usually $100 for, like, a flash card or something. Like, the GC loader mod was 100 bucks. Yeah, you just need an original model GameCube, which is a digital output. As seen here. Uh, Nintendo was future thinking with the GameCube. They wanted 3D with Luigi's Mansion. They had H digital video out. And people were still on CRTs. It's crazy. You do? Heck yeah. Well, if you got 70 bucks US converted to Canadian, sitting around, you want HDMI out. Easy. Alright, let's go back in the video here. There's some screws that I missed. Okay, these okay, these are screws that I can see by the memory card port. So these are a different size, actually. Okay. Well, can't use my magnetic part tray for this then. Let's go back. Use it can come back on. Yeah, for melee things have gone full circle. Now GameCube is better than Wii, because you can get HDMI out. And you can run homebrew on GameCubes pretty easily. As well. Wait, what's happening with the sound cloud? There we go. Alright, so just as a little reminder. Got the song requests on. It's a rarity for me. Alright, I got tiny screwdriver. Yeah, I guess for, for Melee, there's especially a lot of ways. Memory card mods. There's game save exploits. Like, you could have Wind Waker, that Wind Waker disc in, and then as the game starts, it actually just runs homebrew. Buy a later version of Action Replay that does that. Alright, so these screws seem to be different for the memory card port, so I'm putting them in a different thing. This metal's kind of flimsy. I mean, be a little careful. Yeah, I think the uh, Wind Waker exploit is actually basically the same thing as the OG Wii exploit. Like the open up Wii homebrew from Twilight Princess. Alright, so we got some metal plates here from the memory card port, so I'm gonna have to keep track of these. A little scary. Don't want to lose parts. Are you just homebrew with Ocarina of Time? Interesting, I guess... 3DS Homebrew got so, was so advanced that I don't think I had to download anything to homebrew mine. Alright, I think this is all screw, so now I can actually just lift up. Alright, yeah, now I can lift this up. Oh, wow! And there we go, there's the disk drive. It literally just comes undone. That's kind of wild. So here's the inside of the GameCube. Here's the heatsink for that PowerPC processor. <sighs> it's 
So this plug right here is why this mod is so easy. If it was soldered in instead of this plug, it'd be a lot harder. Alright, so I think what the instructions are next is we need to take the screws. We want this metal plate still, we just don't want the disk drive. Okay, so let's shove the GameCube over, don't need it. Yeah, at some point I need to homebrew my Wii U. I can use it to play a bunch of DS games. And we got a song here. Wii hardware mods? Oh yeah, the site I got this GC loader from. The same guy sells an HDMI Wii mod. I think that mod you have to solder. For like the majority of video mods, you have to solder them. I think I've looked into Atari 2600. If you've like the early oldest models of Atari 2600. There's a plug-and-play video mod. Alright, looks like we got screws underneath here. So we need to take all these out. Wait, what? Wow. Never heard of that Blu-ray mod for Wii. Okay, that's not the right size bit. Don't want to strip out the screws. Okay, we just got... <laughs> Kyle just requested all Silent Hill music. Respect it. I'm a little confused here. Uh-oh. I want to strip these out, but, uh... Wait, what? Wait, what was this mod? A little confused here. Blue... You mean Blu-ray discs? Or a video mod? Or a Wii? Alright, now these screws are coming out. I just had to go through eight different bits. Oh, Blu-ray discs. On a Wii? Yeah, I've never heard of that, but I guess... I guess if you... You're super early in the... Wii homebrew scene, before you could use SD cards. Be the way to do it. Okay, these screws for the disk drive are not fun. Maybe I'm accidentally stripping them out. Oh, okay, so you could play Blu-rays on the Wii. But since it was on the Wii, the video was only 480i. I get it now. You could get an expensive PS3 that overheats, or you could just get a Wii to play Avatar Blu-ray on. 
It's like a... It's gonna be the next generation time capsule nostalgia thing. It's like, wanna feel old? Here's a PS3 with the Avatar Blu-ray preloaded. 4K Wii. That's actually what the next Switch is gonna be. They're going back to the Wii. They're calling it the Wii... 8. Alright, well, we got the metal plate, so I think this is all we need. So here is the disk drive. We got some chips. So supposedly if I really didn't want to buy the GC loader or, or use it, if I really wanted to keep using GameCube discs, which is it? I do collect them, so... Technically, I don't have any use for my GameCube discs now, hardly, with this mod. I can put them in the Wii, but... Oh, here it is. So this... Is this going to focus... This right here is a potentiometer. I think, apparently what you can do is you can turn this to adjust the laser. And I could adjust the laser to try and get the disk drive to work, but... If I have to take it apart this much to do that, then I might as well replace the whole drive. Okay. So I think what we do now is we have this 3D printed piece of plastic. Not really sure actually. Let's let's go to the, the video. Let's have to pause this. Back to the video. Wait, what would a Wii U mod do? So we see you already as HDMI. Alright, we're skipping ahead. Okay, so this goes in here. Alright, fun fact about that. I was given gummy bears with the disk drive cover thing. Just open the package and gummy bears. I guess it's punny. Because they're like the store is laser bear. They gave me gummy bears. So hopefully they're not poisoned or anything. From the 3D printer. Okay, hold up. Okay, homebrew. A lot of there's a lot of stuff you can do to console. It's hard to keep track of. Alright. Here we go. Okay. So this top left hole, we need to put the washer in. Position number three. Yeah, let me look back at the video real quick. Okay, upside down. Wait, no, when it's upside down... Okay. I think it goes like this. So when is Skyward Sword HD playthrough? Uh, in 10 years. Alright, once again, I said no fart music. Alright, so we need to use the screws this comes with. That's oh, got standoffs. Dude, this is like a motherboard. What? Alright, so these screws are tiny, so I can't lose them. Which is why I'm going to pour them straight on the floor. All 
All right, it's kind of chaotic to show what I'm doing. Basically, this goes on here. It's got like motherboard standoffs right here and here. Screw them in. It's simple. Wait, so where's the washer go? I guess it can go... It goes on the side of the connector inside. Yeah, this only has three screws. Wow. Okay, I see where the big hole is. Now, I can't really show this that well. This type of stuff needs, like, an overhead camera. Spearmental electronic. Uh, hello? Hold up. Oh, okay, these threadings have stickers over them. I was very confused for a second. Yeah. Do try it. Request it. I want to hear all the different requests. I guess there's a little bit of electronic music in the playlist I have set up. Alright, that's, I've never seen that before. The threads for the screw holes were covered up. Alright, screws are going in. Let's freaking go. Ah! Oh yeah, I guess the way I'm doing the music's... I guess right now it's just song requests is staying on. If the list ever runs out, I'm putting on my own music. It's not really a threat, though. I might, I might just pause it and go back to my own anyways. Let the list fill back up. It's whatever. Uh, okay, the screw hole isn't lining up. There we go. So here's the hole I need to use the washer in. Unfortunately, I'm not... Not showing anything. I'm pissed. I'm a paying customer. I can't request farts and you won't even show what you're doing. The stream is a scam. Oh god, okay, I almost dropped the washer on the floor. This is tiny. I'm, I'm tempting fate drop to drop it on the floor, just by doing that. Alright. So now, uh, if I wanted to, if I didn't want this fancy 3D printed piece of plastic... This mod is basically installed. I put three screws in, it plugs back in, and then I just put the GameCube back together. But, uh... You want to also put in the fancy piece of plastic. Alright, so while this is paused, let's... Go back at the instructions. Yeah, I've got an SD card extension. Oh, okay, I forgot this step. Yeah, since this is 3D printed plastic, the threading isn't really there. So we need to go ahead and try to screw in the screws. So we do it from the bottom, it looks like. Okay. Okay. 
Also, is it just me? The camera drifting any? It, it The webcam is just sitting in a cup, so, like, if I accidentally bump the desk, the webcam just shakes around. It's kind of funny. I'm spinning. Please stop shaking the webcam. 1,000 stream points to sh hit the webcam. Drink us. What? Alright, a song here. Alright, how do I screw this in? Am I allowed to play music in another language? What? Is that even possible? Alright, this is also why I need to get a real table. Not a, a little uncomfy just sitting in a, uh, on a pillow on the floor. Alright, let's thread these screws in. Oh, I'm not even showing it. Gaming people. Roblox on the Steam Deck. Now, were the Proton Linux Roblox patches recently? I could stream Roblox. My desk at school. Ah, yes. I go to school all the time. It's a joke. Dude, I miss learning. I'm gonna try and learn something. Alright. So what holes have I pre-threaded? I already hit something in French in my own playlist. Not that... I need to do some Duolingo. Brush up on my French. What is this word, Paris? I don't understand that word. Alright. I guess quick tip, if you're bu buying something that is 3D printed, make sure all the screw holes are actually ready. Alright, you're getting lucky with these Googles, Kyle Core. <laughs> A little risky to do it that way. Sorry, I don't know French. Okay. Um, I didn't accidentally strip this screw, did I? Okay. Worst nightmare when working on anything with screws. Stripping the screws. Don't like stripping. Um, are you sure there's not, there's not any other musicians you want to also request? You want to show me that you like Kyle Core? No. Thanks for speaking for him. Alright, my arm is getting... I'm getting jacked just from screwing the screw in. Arm's getting tired. This is like the hardest part of this. You just have to actually use some force to thread the screws. I was going for the puns. This is gonna work. Um. Alright, I just wirelessly ummed. Use the keyboard behind me. 
Monk could backflip emote. Is there a monkey flip emote? I don't know about. Alright, so there's only four screw holes? Okay. I think I threaded all four of them then. Added to channel. Okay, bye. Oh, is that your next request, Redby? I think there is a slot free. Maybe not, though. Alright, so I threaded the screws. Um, Let's see how this goes on now. It goes on like this-ish. Need the SD extender plugged in. Alright, so I've never seen anything like this, but plugs into the SD card slot and it extends it. I guess that's how it goes. Alright, so I see where it lines up with the holes. Does you know turn me up too much? Turn up. This stream is now a party stream. Let's freaking go. Alright, once again, I can't really show what I'm doing. This is a jank. This is now added. Okay, fine. Okay, fine. That wagon, as it is called. And overhead, I don't know. I feel bad. I mean, I'm kind of feel bad that I'm not really showing what I'm doing, but... Kinda, right? So there's a screwdriver right here. That's all you need to know. Let's see. Screw in the corner here. What is happening? There's something Zach said about you guys. Kind of, you're kind of proving him right. But right, anyways, let's not make, me not make as many callbacks. Only make callbacks this stream. If you've never been here, too bad. Can't understand a thing I'm saying. Wait a minute. Called yourself cool? I'll I'll accept it. You love Katamari. I'm playing word association in my brain now. Okay, I was like, is this Silent Hill? Every Now if I don't look at the title of the stream, I just think it... Or the title of the song. I think it's from Silent Hill. This is not, though. It's a jam.
Okay. Oof. This heat in this room is about make, to make me say sheesh. Alright, something tells me I could just not just not respond to chat for like 10 minutes and you guys would still go crazy. It's okay. The whole point. The point of Twitch.tv is to just go crazy. Like that Kesha song. Go insane. Whatever the rest of the lyrics are. Uh, okay. Dang it. Alright, well, I've stripped, like, two of the screws, but no big deal. Strip... What's life without stripping a screw? I'll never have to take this out, right? I'm just thinking about that headboard. Alright, someone help me here. What do you do with the strip screw? You just cry? My wife is over. Alright, I'm sorry, this stream was actually a test, uh... A test fun by the admins of Twitch. Unfortunately, everyone here has failed. Bullshit blazing. I haven't heard that one. I'm sure if I hung around my middle school age cousin and hear, and hear a bunch of stuff like that. Alright, so I think this is all together now. If I shake it, it doesn't come apart. I got the drive replacement chip here, mounting thing here. So you can just pop an SD card in and out here. Speaking of, I I just don't know the word. All right, so here's how the fit works. Let's check the fit before we put it it in all the way. SD card. Okay, that's weird. So it plugs in. It doesn't go flush. It kind of sticks out like this. Okay, sure. Okay, so I guess now we just put everything back together. Uh, I'm the youngest here. I'm actually an old person online sort of stream. the clearance like with the top not sure we'll see when i uh put the top on what if i just leave my gamecube topless super clean this guy says super clean a lot in this video 
They've been skipping around, so you haven't been able to hear it. But this mod is super clean. <laughs> okay, never mind. I can just leave the video play for playing for a minute. GameCube convertible mod. Alright, yeah, so I plugged it back in. I don't know if I can do that. Okay, so I think now, so what I need to do is just I'll put the front screws on for the memory card. I want to test this before I put it all the way back together. I, th I think we're good. But just in case, I'm not. So yeah, let me... Hi. That's not what I meant to do. Oh god. Taking you guys on a ride. Alright, the webcam just looked like it was like mad sagging. Like, 2005 Gene Sagan. I guess that's okay. I probably, probably just shouldn't have messed with it, but you can't stop me. Alright, so let's put the... Tiny Memory Card Assembly back together. Plug on what cars you own. So I have a 2002 Accord. Dang. Are old, old cars common? I, I've been under the impression my whole life that, like, old cars aren't common. At least in the United States. They're, like, not common in the northern states. I have found true in my... Couple years of living up north. My 2006 Toyota Matrix. It's like one of the older cars I see around. <laughs> Dude, I just died in real life. Why? Why did that happen? Are we good now? Okay, for some reason my webcam just decided to commit Sudoku. That's actually what happened. It was hearing me make way too awful of jokes and was like, just get me out. Please stop. See how long it takes me to get these memory card thingies back in. What's even the point of these? I guess, I think these are grounding plates. Hold up. Can I show this? This is some electronics engineering, okay? So on the back of this memory card PCB, there's this, this metal contact area. Um, unfortunately, the webcam is doing a terrible job of showing it. Alright, like, this This here is a contact area. And then on this side of the the bracket I'm putting in has a plate that pushes those contacts. I think it's just grounding. So I think the chassis is grounded. It's generally how, like, self-contained electronics, like a phone works. It can't actually touch the ground, so... Just, like, mounting plates are used as ground. I guess, I mean, I guess the GameCube, the GameCube could touch the ground, but the power plug doesn't have ground. Broken Sybil. Alright, 
Oh god. Am I just stripping all these screws? Please, no stripping. Alright. This got me noited. Alright, you can't see my head, but this is a head bopper. The classic breakbeat. Okay, yeah. Is this visible? Let me see. Can we get it to focus on this? Oh god, the tearing. Please focus on the screwdriver. Oh! Oh! Just want to show you the tip. There's metal shavings. Okay, whatever. Being auto-censored by Twitch. I'm definitely stripping some of these screws because I'm getting metal shavings all over stuff. New. Can't even use a webcam. Oh, and I'm sorry. Even a song title in Polish made me think, should I put it on the two albums I've listened to that are in Polish? Just on. Add them to the playlist. I feel like listening to some Mihi here, however you say it. It's too weeb. I guess I was gonna say, kind of reminds me of KKV. I wouldn't know how to jet. Well, I guess this is like an outsider. This doesn't ring a weeb bell. The music video is an anime. The song's in French. And just a synthy pop song to me. What albums? If there's Warsaw, yeah, I listened to Warsaw Village Band in Mihihi. However you say their name. They're both kind of folksy albums. I need a bigger screwdriver. Oh, I have one. Remember, always use the right tool for the right job. How to use tools. That's my point. Listen, this is a good song, okay? Don't feel insecure about it. That's my point. I think the screws that I stripped are done, dealt with. I can just put the memory card assembly back on. Yeah. It's grounded. Okay, so let me put the fan back here on, and then I'm, I'm going to test the mod and see if it works. I'm too cool. You're so freaking cool. Always wanted someone to say that to me. I've lived my whole life. Just please, will someone tell me I'm cool? Oh god. I'm about to sh I'm about to sh cross thread these screws. How to frick up your GameCube tutorial. Anyways, I like ketchup. 
Yeah. Is ketchup the thing that I've kind of turned around on? As a kid, I guess as a kid, like, I'd be okay with ketchup. But I wouldn't want it with fries. I'm like, I want pure fries. I just want the potatoes. Don't give me any dip. Are you kidding me? Nowadays, uh, like a lot of stuff to dip with fries. Ketchup, fry sauce, which is just mayonnaise and ketchup together. Uh, okay, I remember that from French. Instead of uh, you go uh, en français. Allez. Yeah, I do be stripping these screws, though. It just won't tighten. I like ketchup, but only on Sundays. I think the screwdriver is better. No. <laughs> Help! I desperately need help with these screws. So many screws, my right arm is getting tired. So many. It's okay, I don't think I've ever been called cool. Because I don't remember. Back, back in high school, wouldn't be considered the cool guy. Oh god, now's not the time for posture check. My posture is definitely poop. I don't have a chair. Like, look behind me. There's no chair. What the? <laughs> okay. Is that... Oh my... That, I feel like that's like a confidence killer. What the heck? They used ketchup on your pizza. It's nice you made this pizza for us and all, but... We're just gonna throw so much ketchup on it, we can only taste ketchup. That's okay with you. Oh, hold up. I just fricked up. Two of these screws need the fan controller above them. They use ketchup on everything you make. I'm gonna throw the trash on it. I mean, at least that's direct. That's blunt. Maybe they just don't like food. They put ketchup on all the food they eat. They just get a uh, cone of ice cream, ketchup. Waffle, ketchup. Spaghetti, ketchup. Pierogi, ketchup. What about a... <laughs> oh my... Why well, finish that? What about a pierogi that's filled with ketchup? That'd be great, right? I don't want to... Don't want to think about that one. Okay, I am stripping the crap out of all these screws. I do not like this. Let's see if I can find another screwdriver. This is dumb. I have to have a bit that's better.
Alright. Oh yeah, thanks for the single bit as well, Kalma. I didn't specifically acknowledge the bit. Alright, so I just came back with a bunch of bits, seeking a bits. Hopefully one of them works. Got a small enough screwdriver tip. Or big enough, I guess. I have to do a cooking stream. Ketchup pierogi. Obviously, that's delicious, right? Alright, this screw bit is way better. Well, it was. I'm gonna assume that all these are in. Now, this screw is like mega rounded off. Um, that sucks. Let's spend it all in one place. Thanks for the Uno. Really... Really come in clutch. Okay, I was about to say wise. How about it in the queue? Alright, sounds like it's time to put on some Deco and Yamei, however you say their name. Wait, what the heck? Hold up. I didn't know this was a thing. There's a battery? Just right behind the controller ports. Uh, so that's how your Animal Crossing town works. And it's soldered on, unfortunately. I can't replace it. So, one day my Animal Crossing town will die. Alright, so I need to test this now. We're gonna plug this in open, and hopefully this gives me a picture. We'll see. Why are you eating pasta? Why are you looking like pasta? <laughs> Yo, this goes hard. Exactly. That's why I just want to put on some Yamai next. It's like this. V music, as it's called. Alright, sorry to pause. Time for the moment of truth. I'll put on some different songs. Alright, let me plug in the GameCube and we'll see what happens. It explodes. Uh, what? Oh. Oh, no. Hmm. 
Okay, well, I gotta find my power cord real quick. Give me a minute. All right, it's time for the moment of truth. Oh god, the mic peaked. <laughs> Sorry to anyone's ears. Oh, it's already on. Um. Okay. Let me BRB. Hey. No, I mean, this we'll see. Uh, so yeah, that's not good. Maybe I didn't broke it, but uh, it's not right. I guess there's like one of three things that could be wrong. I'm gonna hope it's the simple thing, which is just that I didn't uh, put the right thing in the disk drive. In the SD card, I guess. So let me try a different SD card, too. Because the one I was using was giving me issues. And I was trying to format it. Let me have the music back on. So let me put my music back on, so that way I don't miss any song requests. All right, see what happens. Hold your breath. Oh, wow. This SD card is ancient. It's from when I delivered pizza, and it's got an episode of Ludwig and Slime off the sticks. Episode 9. Okay. Well, 
Well, let's see if this delivers me gaming. That's what I need now. Deliver this. That is a good episode. Yeah, that whole show was good. It's the only thing with Ludwig that I've consumed. Oh, there we go, it's working. Let's freaking go. Okay, so maybe it was the SD card, maybe it was the, uh... I don't even know. Oh, where's the music? What the heck? What happened to the music? Okay, the music just stopped playing in the... Sorry, to everyone's ears. Just stopped playing for some reason. Let's freaking go. I'm pissed. No music. Alright, let me plug in a controller just to go through the menu. So it looks like I can update the firmware in my GC loader. Which is kind of jank because I just bought it. <laughs> okay, I didn't bother getting the firmware update because I'm like, I just bought this a week ago. There's no way he sold me one where the firmware is not up to date, is it? Uh, I guess that's the case. I mean, he has to... I don't know how he would update it. Without putting it in a GameCube. Won't fault the creator too much. It's working. Get hype. Let me actually try something out. Let's see if I can boot a game with it then. Wait, can this just play MP3s? That's kind of funny. Alright, it's doing it. I don't have the capture card audio coming through, though, so I can't... I guess I could, though. Let me do that. See if the sound's working. Uh, Numpat's freaking out, though. Alright, here we go. We got the GameCube playing... MP3 files. I can't turn the volume up, though. Alright. So anyways... That was only three years ago. Back then, Ludwig was a nobody. I'm like, hey, this Ludwig guy is funny. It's the funny guy that does the stuff with slime on this podcast. What did I know?
All right, let's get back to modding. We got to put the GameCube back together now. It works, though. It makes me hype. All right, so song requests can come back. Among Us rap. Uh, and I just put all the screws back in. I know how to do that. Now, he used to be called Slime's Friend. He was on the roast of someone. Before anyone knew who he was. I guess I think I kind of I knew at the time he was a commentator when the roast happened. Let's use that as an inspirational tale. No matter what you're doing, in like three years, two years, it's be in a completely different place. All right, we're screwing now. I'm gonna get the screws screwed in. Yeah, now time for Red Dead Redemption soundtrack. Alright, it's pretty nice to know that this mod is working. I didn't want to, like, put it all the way together and then, like, it's not actually plugged in being an issue or something. Alright, hopefully, hopefully it doesn't sound weird. Like, Polish sounds different when it's not, like, in a... Somber folk song, or I guess, like, people trying to sound like witches in the middle of the woods. Also, hopefully everyone's loving that ratcheting screwdriver sound. I'm sorry? Wait, what are you sorry for? It's like, if you sing English... Here in the Beatles, versus... Here in Lil Nas X. If you weren't a native speaker, might be surprised they're the same language. I like count once again, I'm not even showing what I'm doing. Just doing it. Listen, I got some screws in this metal parts tray. Oh, they're sticking to the screwdriver. That's it. Alright, so these are the last three. Should all try and sound like witches? Yes. Sure. Every every single person on the planet. Let's do it. New initiative. There's talk like a pirate day, there needs to be talk like a witch day. Alright, so putting these all back in is way easier when you don't Don't use a giant bit that strips the screws, or a small one. 
All right, so I think I, that's all the screws. I have the bottom ones, and two of them went somewhere. And two screws that went uh somewhere. Uh, two screws that went in the original casing that are just extra. All right, speaking of folk song. Let's go back to the guide. Let me make sure I'm not missing anything. See, he says super clean. Alright, we gotta do this. Super clean. I mean, it is super clean. And you can't make fun of him. Alright. Yeah, I guess we're basically done. Yeah, I didn't think this would take very long. Let's see. I have the top here. I thought maybe I'd have to take off these stupid red stickers. I never did explain the stickers. Once again, I guess my dad would just randomly show me stuff on eBay all the time. One time it was stickers that went on your DS and your GameCube. So it had to be like 2005. I just got the stickers and put them on the consoles. I mean, I could peel off these stickers and there'd be pristine purple under. So maybe that, that was a good thing. I guess everything just goes back on. Hold up, this fan on the side here. Uh, you can see the screws. Mess with that. Pokemon Hunt. What new release? Uh, how about none? I'm just doing Chaos Gaming, okay? I still need to beat Loop Hero. That's the next release I'm playing. Okay, I don't know why the fan won't. It doesn't go all the way down, but whatever. I'm just gaming. I'm not playing Pokemon Unite. I know I saw it was coming out like the other day, and I'm just like, I don't like MOBAs. Frick it. I don't care. Usually like play messing around with new releases, but no MOBAs. Alright, time to put the screws back in. I got the game bit screwdriver, because... Will it focus? Please, webcam. No, not my hand. Oh, it almost focused. It's, it's a weird bit. That's all you need to know. Man... Which are the Monster Slayers? Is that actually a new release? What is that? I haven't heard of that. For a second, I thought you put Witcher and then Monster Hunter. There is new Monster Hunter stuff. Witcher Pokemon Go. Oh. Unfortunately, I don't know anything about the Witcher universe, so... I can't be that excited. I guess I already go outside. And sometimes I go outside to places that don't have 4G. Or 3G. I hope I didn't strip that game bit. I play the Amazon game. That one bricked someone's 3090. 
that's gotta be that's gotta be a horrible feeling. Like you're just gaming and then your graphics card breaks because of the game. Alright, so these covers. So what goes on the bottom here? What would have gone on the bottom here is the modem or the broadband adapter for GameCube. So you plug it in and then on the side here would be an Ethernet port. And do LAN Kirby's Air Ride. Alright, it's time to read the books. Maybe Comet is going to pop off for the Witcher Monster Slayer. Alright, and this one's empty on purpose because this is where the Game Boy player goes. Which I guess I could put back on. Um, unfortunately, I noticed on the bottom here, my GameCube's missing a foot. Right here. I don't know where that went. It's just a little plastic piece, so I'm sure I could buy a replacement, but it's just missing. Alright, so let's check the fit. Look at this. Open it up. We got the clean black tray. I guess I could have gotten purple, but it's black from the disk drive, right? Put in your SD card. There we go. Here's the fit. So it kind of sticks out, but... I mean, it's kind of hard to get out, otherwise. There you go. It's boring and way too hard. Wait, the Witcher Monster Slayer game? Among Us Rap. Wait, what is up with the song request queue? I thought it was at the end. You have to click and fight and time block? Wait. But if it's like Pokemon Go. And I guess you just walk and then find an encounter. Can you dodge in real life? Just run around the enemy? So that could be kind of unfortunate. It spawns an enemy in a closet. You have nowhere to go. Alright, so the mod is in. Um, I guess I'll get the Game Boy Player reinstalled. I am curious about the GameCube feet. Gotta figure out where to get those. Alright, so here's the Game Boy Player. It just plugs in to play your Game Boy games. I mean, you kind of just set... Just set the GameCube on it, basically, because it fits perfectly to the bottom, but... Just plug it in. It's got two flathead screws we have to mess with. Came back and you've a cheater GameCube. I didn't see that message. And how do big. There's gotta be like big streamers that somehow read every message in their chat. Like that person that said. One person that their only message was I fart in my bed. And they typed it in the middle of everyone else spamming. I still saw that. Doing dodges and rolls in the middle of my town. I mean, like, you know, you just, it's motion. So, like, the enemy, like, let's say, enemy, let's see, the screwdriver is the enemy. All right, so we're looking at the enemy. And we just, we don't have to dot, we just can walk. We can just walk to this side, and now we're on this side. Flank it. Dead. Killed the screwdriver. 
That's how the game works, right? Alright, so here it is. Completed. The Cheater GameCube. So you still need an SD card... Memory card thing. Because, uh... You can't write to the SD card in the disk drive slot, which kind of makes sense. Now, the, Nintendo didn't write the GameCube software thinking, you'll be able to write to the disk drive. So if you want to, like, save settings or something, you got to put it on this one. Save to the memory card. Although, apparently the guy that's making this is working on save support. I don't know how that's going to work, but... It's interesting. Oh man. How does this work? I guess it's in slot 2 normally because on this memory card there's a save exploit. Or... The Legend of Zelda, Wind Waker. Because this is that was my old way of booting homebrew. I'd use the Wind Waker disc. It is a save on this memory card. It then loads homebrew on this one. I guess the camera is mirrored. So yeah, this is slot 2. This is slot 1. I don't need this copy anymore. At least to boot homebrew. Alright, so here's what's left. We got two screws and a disk drive, so... If anyone wants a spare GameCube disk drive... Okay, I'll take it. I'll take all your copies of GameCube games. And I still need them to put in the Wii so I can rip them legally. So N Nintendo doesn't sue me. Sure Nintendo will love the explanation. No, I homebrewed your Wii console that you made. So I can make a copy of my GameCube games. This is actually what I'm going to have to do. Because honestly, I think that's easier than trying to find a ROM site. Maybe not. The counselor is at your door. Open up. Okay, I don't breathe fire in real life. Just hit me on the down low. I got you. Alright, so I'm going to figure out some side stuff. We'll leave the music off, because let's look at YouTube. So what are we talking about? Wait, is that... Are you deferring on purpose? Alright, I'll, I'll play along. What are we talking about? Bowser's got a gun. Alright, so if we look in the comments here, someone... Where'd you get that cool pad that holds your screws? Got an... Affiliate Amazon link. Be sure to click his Amazon link. Oh, here's a way. Here, how to make the GameCube intro fully load. Okay, so I followed the steps in this video and it messed me up. So does he show it at the end? Yeah, he does. Alright, yeah, so that's what happens. By default, it just instantly goes to the homebrew. <laughs> and we don't see the GameCube logo. Come on, you gotta have the classic GameCube sound. That's the first com comment. And... Yeah, he made a YouTube video. I did the steps here, but it didn't work. Restoring the GameCube startup animation. Yeah, Nintendo already tried to gas poison me. I did get fixed today. I could use my oven and stove today. It was pretty sick. Could cook actual food. So I basically only cook with the oven and the stove most of the time.
Alright, so this is like a three minute video basically saying download an update, mostly. Now he goes in the ISO folder. This is what I did before and it didn't work. But it could have been the SD card. I think it's the SD card. Alright, so I'm going to assume my SD card was sus. What did I cook? Made some salmon... Zucchini squ roasted zucchini squash and then just had leftover mashed potatoes that were instant. I'm listening. I'm not, though. I'm not, though. I'm not listening to what I say. I'm honest. Alright, so let's try the different thingy. I'm gonna go to, oops, this, and let's see if I can get the GameCube boot logo. That'd be pretty hype. Let's take out the old SD card. Here it is. Oh. Alright, so, uh, anyone got any song requests? So let me get my stuff on. Oh, okay. Now you can still queue up. Just let this one song finish. Alright, so we're going to name this one thing Old Boot. Didn't mean to make anyone cry. Alright, hold your breath. We're gonna get the boot logo. What? We got the boot logo? All right, there's a little, there's a little Easter egg too. I'm gonna restart the GameCube. Might have never heard this one. Alright, so we got some funny, we got the funny sounds. Alright, so we got this working. So I guess my old theory was correct. The old SD card was just... sus. <laughs> Basically.
That's kind of funny. Alright, uh... Uh, so what do I do now? Alright, I'll stop saying that word. Alright. Remember back in, like, May when I was complaining about Mogus memes? Uh... Actually, I'm actually like, uh, what do I do now? Oh, oops. Yeah, okay, bye. I don't have anything else. I guess I, I need to clean up. Anyone want to help me clean up? Yeah, the other SD card I had was just weird. And I guess I can try out stuff on the GameCube. Let's, let's clean this stuff up first. How does just a stream of watching someone clean sound? Add some tunes here. Unfortunately, it looks like Nightbot doesn't really keep song requests. Song request history. I guess I can use the chat log, where Nightbot says it's added a song. Alright, so let's, uh, so this is what I had to get off of Amazon. So here's the game bit screwdriver that I needed. It came with another game bit, a smaller one, and a tri-wing. I thought it's used, like, on the controller and stuff. Gotta have a spare tri-wing. We need some cash for the plane ticket. Okay, just to clean. So I guess what I can do is, uh, hold up. So here's the business card of the people that made the 3D printed dry thing. Oh, it's a sticker. Okay. I thought, I thought it was a business card. It's a sticker. Well, if I put stickers on my laptop, I would do that. Thank you. Now I am in business. A wee business in now. What I'll do with this is I will put the old drive. And then I'll put these old screws in there, too. Smart. Frick. Yeah, the shortcut method is a little too risky. You get errors or you get the wrong song. Alright, what was in the GC loader box? Now here's another business card. Here you go. Scan this QR code real quick. Got the GC loader. Scan this for the manual. Uh, the song is actually 15 minutes. Alright, I respect it. Alright, here's the quick setup. If you want to read this. Number one ranked gamer. I, I remember that. Remember rocket jumping? Copy a homebrew or backup ISO image and rename it to boot.iso. Alright, do I keep the business card? Alright, they got the a Gekian, as in a hundred Gex, Gekian vocal filtering. I like saying music is Gekian. Don't fear the Reaper. Alright, so I guess here's the disk drive. It's just in a box. I don't know if it's actually useful to keep in a box like this, but I'm doing it. Okay, this box won't close, though. It's a bit of an issue. Whatever. Cleaning up, okay? 
Bulls on parade. Rage against the machine. I have to do something. Just keep cleaning. I gotta put the screwdrivers up. Got the iFixit kit. I'm sponsored, okay? Listen, I'm just as big as Linus. iFixit sponsors me to use their products. Buy them right now. Don't even bother looking at any other brand. Any other alternative. Just like me. <laughs> Alright, this is a PC building tool kit. It's at the parts bin. It's got all these other tools I don't really use. There's, yeah, there's these hex head screwdrivers. That's about it. I'm not using this. Okay, this is what you meant by boomer music. We just got Megadeth. I don't think I've ever listened to 80s metal. Except for one... One song. I don't remember the band. Alright, so I got tools. At least are ready to get put up. Um, um, all right, so look at this. We're all cleaned up. I guess, do I try and see if the game, I want to see if the GameCube works with the one thingy. See if it works with the SD card, memory card thing. I think I can just set up on the computer now, though. I'm done with the IRL setup stuff. That mod took like an hour and a half to do. That's a really simple mod. Like, if you're not farting about with a stream, it probably can take like 45 minutes, maybe. I guess the main learning curve is just the software. You gotta know about Swiss, the homebrew loader for GameCube. That's about it. Fart. When I say fart, farting about... Been f I've been farting all day. Alright, let's check. Yeah, let me get everything set up so I can sit on the computer. Maybe it's time for BuzzFeed quizzes or something. Okay, the GameCube's still on. Okay. Well, hello. I do have a face. I was just keeping it hidden. It was a super secret. Um. Okay, I almost spilled my water. That would have been tragic. Farting. He's ready to fart now. Okay, we're we're rocking now. 
I don't normally listen to a lot of metal. It's not that I hate the genre. I guess I just don't find myself listening to it a lot. Let's see what we can do with this GameCube now that we've got all this stuff going on. Memory card slot B. There we go. So now I can go under ISOs. Um, this is all I have right now. So this is what the workflow would be like for this. B sussy. I haven't refreshed any of my chats. Can't see it. The B does not exist. Wait, what happened? Alright, let's just see if this works. Audio streaming, no. That's uh, patching the game. Also, the mic is probably... My bad. That should be way better. Okay, sorry if I was blowing people's ears out. <laughs> I had the microphone gained because I was far away from it, and now it's right next to my face. Alright, I got a little remix going on. Alright, so this, like, boots up just fine. Now, that's actually fine. <laughs> just have a red line in OBS. Oh, it was, it was actually fine. I saw a red line in OBS, so I'm like, oh god, I'm blowing ears out. Give me a little quiet. It's probably because of the all. Oh, there's... Two different things of music going on. Let's do this. Maybe my ears are poopy. Alright, now I'm right next to the mic. Alright, let's see if stuff requiring disc reads works. So we need to do Pokemon Stadium. Okay. It's weird. Disc load time is being simulated because that wasn't instant. Turn on all the items. My ears are poopy. I don't even have any stages unlocked. So that makes sense. Mmm, it seems to load faster than the actual disk drive still. Also, the game aspect ratio is a little sussed. Remember when I said I was going to stop saying that word? <laughs> Alright, well this is what this mod lets me do, basically. I can just play GameCube games without getting the disc out. Which really works because the disc drive just wasn't working. 